Hi guys, it's me Chase and I'm back. This is a tutorial for a bracelet called Celtic or Celtic Wings. Okay, and it was created by, again, the Dude Loomer. Tini Pulseras. Very cute bracelet. And if you notice, I did three designs without the beads and one with the beads. They look so pretty. I like the detail inside. Look at what I did here. I used white and the colors only inside the center bands. And then for this one, I used two colors, blue and that other one. And then you have your tin, um, what's that again? Sparkle maroon, I think, yeah. And then here I alternated the firework colors and here I used a mix. So it really depends on your taste. This one is a very easy to make bracelet and it's called Celtic Wings by Tilly Pulseras. So let's get started. We will be using three colors, okay? So I'll be using one color per segment, which is this one, one segment. This is one segment. This is a different segment, so, okay? So let's get started. Get your hook, and then you will start creating your cat band. So start with your cat band, okay? This is an eight band setup. So you just place that starting band right there. So get that other side, one of the cap bands, which is the first one, so get that. Then you will add the first of the two that you will add. So you will add two, okay? Two per side, two per side, and then one center band. Basically, that's your pattern, okay? So I'll get the first color, add the first one, and loop the two, and get this very first band, and then close. Add another one, and loop the two bands, get the first band and close. Okay? And then you repeat on the other side. So you remove this first band, reclaim that cap band, put it back, and then get your two bands now, the first color. Add the first one and loop these two. You will reclaim this very first band again. And then close get the second one unloop the two bands and reclaim this very first one and close John. okay and then now you will get a band that you will loop under all of these okay so you have to pay attention because you are supposed to switch these two bands outside put them in the center like this like that okay because when you reclaim you will reclaim these so but since it's harder to do it that way i will show you a technique that i use get your center band and unloop all of these the seven okay so your center band and then you unloop all seven bands keep the order so you don't get confused okay so one two Three, four, five, six, and seven. Okay, now you are supposed to reclaim, you're supposed to cross these two bands with the center. So here's what you do you go on top of the one beside the hook and go under. So ignore this first one, okay? Go under the first two, go under the two bands that are in the center those two like that okay reclaim those then now you will cross this one over here see much easier right and then you see these two neck next two bands you simply this is hard but you will be you will learn once you once you get used to it you simply pull the farther band on top of the band inside like this I do it this way see look what I'm doing I'm pulling it like this and then I will pick up this other one it's hard to show on camera let's see there you go under that other one so they get crossed Ta -da! then you just untwist it if it gets twisted there okay and then you will reclaim this last band and close Okay, now you switch this band over here, 
It's a bit confusing in the beginning, I know, but when you get used to it, you will be thanking me because it's so much easier. So there. Okay, that's how your bands are supposed to look like. Now you will add the next two colors per side. Okay, so you get your next two colors, purple. And loop the three bands, the half. Okay, and then reclaim this very first one and close. Get the second one and loop the two bands. Reclaim this very first one and close. Okay. Then you go to the other side and repeat. Get your two next colors. First one, unloop the three. Reclaim the first one. Close. Then you get your second. Unloop the two. Reclaim the first one. And close. Ta da And then now you go back to the center band. Okay, so you get your center band again. And then if you want, here's another style. And loop all six again. Well, seven rather. One, two, three, four. Now here, what you can do here, so that you don't have to keep unlooping everything, is you simply unloop. So you have one, two, three, four. You simply unloop number six over like that. So it's already there. And then, number five, you will cross over the gray, just like that. And then you will also unloop this one, see? But I think that's more confusing. So if I were you, just do as I did earlier. You unloop. Wait, what happened? Ah, oh, yeah, here. It gets pulled, so I get confused inside there. So you just unloop all one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. It's, it's still e this is what this one is still easier. Okay. Then you go and skip this first one. Go under the two. Okay. Then, like I said earlier, and then you just cross this over. Okay. Another way that you can cross these two is you just cross it like this. If you're good with your hands, then. That's much easier there. So you cross them, and now you will reclaim it. Okay, there. And then also this last one, and close. And then you switch them again. Ta-da! Okay, then you get the two first colors again. So you get your first one, and loop the three. Reclaim the first one, and close. Get the next one, and loop the two, reclaim this first one, and close. Then you go to the other side. Get your blue, and loop the three. Pick up this first one and close. Get the second blue, and loop the two. Pick up this first one, and close. See? Okay. One last time, and then let us see if we can figure out an easier way to do it. <laughs> Get the center band and loop all seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. And then you skip this first one again, go under the two, next two. And then you cross this one over again. Okay. And then, like I said, it's really much easier. Just pull this over. And then see, then just pick up that band under. It's much easier, really. And then you close. And then you switch the last band again over. And you're done. So you get the next color again. First one. And loop the three. Reclaim this first one. And close. Get another one. And loop the two. Reclaim the first one. And close. Yeah, it's so much faster. Okay. Get the second color and loop the three. Reclaim that one sticking out, the first one, and then close. Get another one and loop the two. Reclaim this very first one 
and close. Bladang. Okay. Okay, and now, once you are done, all you have to do is get a single band and loop all eight to four, six, eight. And then you will reclaim the third, this one, number three, and number seven. Oh, wait, no. One, two, three, four, five. That's number six. <laughs> So this is number six and this is number three. And then you close. Ta-da! That is where you place your C clip. Okay, that is super easy. Celtic Wings, created by super talented bloomer, Tini Pulseras. Okay, another dude luma. Very talented dude luma. Okay, and I made four of them because they're so pretty. Okay, so these are your Celtic Wings bracelet created by Tini Polseras. And when you make the bracelet, please don't forget to hashtag Jace Alvarez. Celtic Wings bracelet and Tini Polseras. I'll see you in my next tutorial. Bye!